Anti-Terrorism Task Force has uh, two terror suspects who are wanted. And uh, as you are aware, the, the Joint Anti-Terrorism Task Force comprises of uh, uh, forces from the CMI, ISO Counterterrorism and Crime Intelligence. And these have put up a serious manhunt for two uh, suspected notorious ADF rebels for their alleged roles in the string of attacks using improvised explosive devices within the central business district of Kampala and Butambala, and also uh, for other terror attacks along the Kasese Bondibujo axis uh, with the DRC. The goal of these wanted terror suspects is to murder Ugandans and also cause panic and fear you know, within the community. Uh, we are going to share the first photograph of uh, Kamusi Musa. Kamusi Musa is here. Is uh, the one uh, who replaced uh, the other ADF rebel commander called Njovu, uh, who was arrested by the UPDF Marines in that aggressive pursuit. So he is uh, really wanted. Uh, because it's a threat to it's a threat to to Ugandans. The other picture of his that we have is uh, not so clear, but he still appears like this. So this is uh, Kamusi Musa, uh, who is now the commander of the Splinter ADF group, or cell that was formerly led by Joto Abdul Rashid, alias Njovu. Uh, who was arrested during an aggressive pursuit and fire exchange by the UPDF Marines and CMI on Lake Edward way back on the 1st of November um, uh, uh, 2023. During the fire exchange, you remember very well, uh, the, the uh, two ADF rebels were put out of action and others escaped, including Kamusi Musa, who we have... Uh, our, who is really wanted, and we are going to try very much to ensure that uh, uh, we have him arrested. Then our counterterrorism teams are also hunting for a one, Habib Suleiman, alias Tijana. This photograph was shared yesterday, and uh, for his active involvement in various attacks using locally manufactured IEDs within the greater Kampala areas of Kabalagara, uh, Katoke Nansana, and uh, uh, he's one of uh, uh, the persons uh, linked to the many foiled attacks uh, on uh, crowded places like at Marito Natete, Bundamwaya. Uh, he was linked to the Pastor Kayanja's uh, uh, church attempt, uh, the Chibibi church, churches in Butambala. Now, these two are targeting places that are crowded. But we also want to ask uh, uh, business proprietors and uh, other owners of uh, smaller units, uh, which are soft targets, uh, that they should also be vigilant during this period. Uh, we are advising the public not to approach these two wanted uh, ADF suspects because they're armed and dangerous. Our appeal instead is uh, to anyone who believes they have additional information that could assist in this investigation to uh, contact our National Operations Command Center on the usual telephone numbers of 0800 -199 -699 -0707 Double seven three and uh, zero seven seven six triple nine uh, one three six. A substantial cash reward of Uganda shillings twenty million awaits any member of the public, including journalists, who avails us very credible information that can lead to the arrest of these wanted terror suspects. And to further remind the public that this investigation, like all the others we have handled in the past months and years, 
shows that terrorism still exists. So we call upon all members of the public to be vigilant.